Oh, I freaking blew off a piece of my own thing. Yo, is my like, did I build like a ramming ship? What's going on guys? Welcome back to The Last Leviathan. This is Besiege meets the High Seas. Pirate-like building game. It's freaking epic. It's amazing. I'm having so much fun playing this. And in today's video, we're going to look at Versus, which is the multiplayer, and also the workshop. So I went to Creative just to kind of mess around, and I actually downloaded a workshop item by Kimmy Kicks or something like that, and it's called The Behemoth. Here it is. Look at this monstrosity. And it works really, really well. And the way that you do this is you go to load, and uh, this is where all the ships are that you have. So you have my ships, and then the workshop ships that you've downloaded, and you can browse the workshop. It doesn't work through here, from what I can see, so you go to the workshop in Steam, and you can just subscribe to it, and then it appears in here. And so, then you can just load it up, set sail, and look at this thing. So, I wanted to go into Versus, and I wanted to use this thing. Now, I don't know if that's a good idea or a bad idea, because the people who are probably in that, in this ship class, are probably pretty freaking good. Look at this thing, it's so well done. Like some, got the little tiny rudder down there. Um, okay, so this is one cool thing about this game. So first of all, the scope thing is up here, which is cool, up on the top here. Um, if we point to a certain sign, so like this way, only those guns will fire. We point to the front, those ones fire. Point this way, those ones fire. Same thing if we, you know, hit space to like load off a bunch of them. And then we also have the, uh, the, the uh, automatic cannon too, which you just hold down. And so it's a little, little bit different, it's pretty interesting that uh, you have a couple different fire modes because I can, I can stop and then click again and that's what happens. And so what I thought we would do, or fool here, is this, I think this over here, you can actually blow these this thing up. Somebody made this for that purpose. Can we uh, get, let's see, can we get a view on this cannon here? I don't think I could, I can hit that. I don't think it goes far enough. How far does that go, actually? Wow, that's actually really close. Let's see. If I hit that, I'm going to flip out. Pretty close, though. Okay, you can actually make a ship out of rum barrels. And so, uh, let's do it. Let's make a ship out of rum barrels. Uh, this should be pretty interesting. It's got 400 health. That's not bad. I don't know what to make though. I don't know. I don't know how to go about making it. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, how the heck are we? Oh, I have to do it like that. Okay. Uh, let's put. Okay, we'll make a very basic like thing like that. I kind of want to make like a pontoon like thing, but I don't know how to make. This is like basically making a raft is essentially what the this is the equivalent of making a raft I think. That's what the barrels are. I I'm thinking. So if we just do something like that. First of all, let's just see if this works. And then if it does, we can go from there. Okay. So there's that. Let's see if does that actually test. Let's test this. Wait, can I delete any of these? Um, let's get an actual name for it, maybe. Load. I don't know if I can delete it. Okay. Uh, so let's, let's keep going. Go with that, and then, um, we'll see what we can go, f what we can do from here. Okay, the rum runner is, uh, is ready to go. So, I couldn't get the barrels by itself to work, so I built it kind of like this underside here. It looks, it works very well now. We've got flamethrowers here. Yeah, We've got a spike there. It's kind of like the main thing. We've got actually, I could probably put the better one on here. Let me see. Yeah, so the better ones on there now. We've got cannons, which these cannons are kind of like the. Let's see what do we? What about these second ones here? Forty-two ninety-one. We're still under it. 
Don't want to go up another class if I can manage. There we go. And then we got like these kind of like as boosters. <laughs> it looks pretty funny. Uh, but yeah, so let's go ahead and set sail and see what we can mess some people up. Uh, oh, there's a guy right here. I, I, feel, I think it maneuvers quite well. It's very fast. We're going to have to light this guy up, I think, with the flamethrowers. Holy crap! Get lit! Oh, I shot like to the side somehow. Don't even know how that was possible. Back it up, back it up. Turn it around, turn it around. Here we go. You're mine, dude. You're mine. No! What the heck? Oh, he took a cannon off. Oh, no! Cannon is down. I can't turn. I can't, I can't tight. I can't turn tight enough. Turn it around, turn it around. I don't know how they shoot on the Oh my gosh. Oh no. I don't know how they shoot on the move so well like that. Oh no. I jumped him. Yeah, baby, get lit. The flamethrowers are definitely like one of the best. Oh, he's done. He's done. I just destroyed him. Flipping him over. Flamethrowers is definitely one of the one of the better uh one of the better things cuz they like hit almost all the time. Until I can get better with the cannons, like, not gonna, not gonna work out too well for me. There is another ship right here. Jeez, man, we're getting spotted left and right. It's, it's definitely hard to shoot like this, and it's hard to, not hard to shoot like this. It's hard to shoot when you're not in this mode. Oh, I freaking blew off a piece of my own thing. Yo, is my, like, did I build, like, a ramming ship? Nice side shot, back shot right there, I mean. I think I built like a ramming ship. It's like unintentionally like good at ramming. Flamethrower working under the ground there. Oh, nice, I can shoot from the side. My, uh, it looks like my, my melee is still hanging on, barely. Maybe it's just sitting there, I don't know. It's interesting, you can shoot your own stuff though. Shoot, man. Like, I just think I just did right there. Oh, no, those cannons. Nice. Can we take a sail out, I wonder? He's only shooting the... Oh, my melee! You freaking jerk. Can we... Sh I wonder, can we uh, be very specific with our shots and, like... I think we can... I'm destroying my own ship. And I clicked off of the game again. Um, okay, I have an idea. Let me, uh, I have an idea of how to improve this. We can raise the cannons higher, and I think it will work better. Because the cannons are just shooting our own stuff right now, which is not good. It's so, Why is it so hard to steer sometimes? Like, I don't get it. It's like ridiculously difficult sometimes. I, I don't know if it's the just the f fact that I've it goes too fast or just the setup itself. Oh, I'm gonna surrender this. We gotta figure out. We gotta fix this build, man. Those cannons are like getting screwed up. Um, okay, so let's let's get rid of this. Get rid of this. Let's add other barrels on. Let's see. Hull, barrel, barrel. There we go. Now we can put the cannons up on top, and I think it's gonna work a little bit better. Let's see. Let's try it. Okay, so there we go. A little higher. I think that'll be better. Um, what was the other thing I was going to do? Oh, yeah. So what's the deal with the... It, it's not, like, easily able to steer. I wonder, do we need, like, a fin? One of those keel fins? Is that, does that really matter? Let's see. All right, let's try it now. Maybe it's got something to do with just like the overall motion of the ocean. Oh, those are good. Oh, we just missed those shots. You gotta really work with the uh... <laughs> Oh no. He's gonna light into me. Ah! Oh, you really have to 
Oh, I got a sail. I got a sail. I got a sail. See that? You gotta like time it with the mouse button. I mean the uh, like, you gotta pay attention to the waves and like your pointer and stuff and like, cause it gives you like guidance on how to shoot the best with them. Let's do this. A little low. Oh, got a hit there. Oh, nice. Big hit. So you can control these cannons quite well. I'm getting this, guys. I'm getting it. Oh, just low. Oh, crap. I blew off something. The, it's, the camera controls are also kind of tricky to get used to. Turn. Why are you... That is not the way I'm trying to turn. The heck? There we go. I just, I think I just have to get used to like ship gameplay in general. Not the greatest at it. The thing is too good, too fast for someone good. Oh, almost got the, the uh, their cannon. Oh, big shot. Got it, got the side cannon, nice. This is some intense gameplay. I think we're like fairly evenly, fairly evenly matched. That's not too bad. It, uh, it's definitely really tricky, but it's it's a lot of fun. A cool thing too, guys, if you guys are interested in checking out the ships that I've made in any of the videos, I'm uploading them to the workshop, and so you can go check them out there if you want to try them out yourself. So I've uh, kind of reconfigured this. Put the cannons in the front, put the flamethrowers on the sides, Added some different varying weights in different areas. Why are there so many of these in one spot? What the heck? And uh, it seems to be working a little bit better. So let's just try to find one guy and try to kill him. And see if we can see what this thing can do now. Uh, where is everyone? What the heck? I couldn't find anything in the other one. So I went into versus and I'm facing one of my ships. This is uh, the one, the last one I just made. So hopefully I don't get annihilated. Wow, those were actually really close. Those are gonna be way off. You can see like when to fire based on like the uh, mouse indicator. Too much. Oh, that's gonna be off. We got the flamethrowers on the side, which I'm not too sure about. What in the first person? Good rammed. Oh no, did I just get flipped? No, I didn't. Okay. I thought I got flipped for a second there. Turn. Bring it around. Oh my gosh. I forgot how many guns are on my ship right here. Go for the figurehead. Oh, I got it. I got it. Dude, yeah. Dude, nice. Tearing this thing up. So this is controlled by AI right now, but there, it can't turn in time. I did not make this ship e easily able to... Oh, is that how it's gonna be? He's trying to flamethrower me! Get out of here, bro! That was my idea. They're just out of range. So we need side cannons for sure. Oh gosh, don't let the guns... Oh no, oh my gosh, no. Full stop. Come on. Uh, I, th I think I see my, my issue. I think I see what I was doing wrong earlier with, uh, sh with controlling this thing. Yeah. Look at that side plating. Taking damage, taking tons of damage. This ship, th this ship that I built is like just freaking beastly, man. It's got so much like stuff to blow up. We take out the rudder. Are you able to actually hit the rudder? Oh, I don't think so. It's yeah, I think you can, but you gotta wait for it. 
Yeah, it's difficult, man. Can you imagine like large freaking naval battles against other people, other people's built things? It'd be so freaking fun. I cannot see at all what's that camera mode is too much. Okay, turn it over. Okay, I see. If I if I don't give any like forward motion and just turn, I can turn a lot easier, a lot faster. I want to light this dude up. I want to light it up. Here we go, flamethrower. Wait, it does it every time I do it, so it won't fire against me. Oh, that's kind of lame. It'll only fire fire the cannons if if I click. Wait, no, that's not true. Wait, so like it? Yeah, look, I'm 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 controlling that. Ah oh, man. Kind of lame. We got the big cannons on here too. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway, guy. Thank you so much, guys. Anyway, guy. Guy. The one guy who's watching this video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed this uh, episode. You know, I like building these different crafts, and I'm really excited to see like the workshop stuff that people make. Uh, I'm. I'm really excited to see the stuff people make because they're going to make some awesome things. And there's already some great things in the workshop, which is crazy uh, since it just is not even out yet. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'll see you guys in the next one.